Hello, my name is John Mound, and I'm an associate professor of geophysics at the University of Leeds. I have a particular interest in understanding the behavior of the Earth's deep interior. Today I'll be answering the question, is the Earth's magnetic field about to flip? In my research, I study how the Earth's magnetic field is generated deep beneath our feet in our planet's liquid iron core. This vast ocean of liquid iron is constantly churning away, and as it flows, it rearranges our magnetic field. Sometimes that rearrangement even completely flips the field in what's known as magnetic reversal, with the north magnetic pole crossing the equator into the southern hemisphere and the south magnetic pole moving to the Arctic. We know from the magnetic field records in ancient rocks that the Earth's magnetic field has flipped many times in the past. In fact, it has flipped nearly 50 times over the last 10 million years, with the last reversal occurring 780,000 years ago. However, the time between reversals is highly variable, and sometimes the field doesn't flip for millions of years. So just because it's been longer than usual since the last reversal, that doesn't necessarily mean that the next reversal is due. You may have heard that the field has been getting weaker over the last few centuries, and that over the last few decades, the North Magnetic Pole has started moving unusually fast. These could be early signs that we are headed into a reversal, but the field is not particularly weak compared to its long-term average, and the rock record shows that the field often fluctuates quite a bit without flipping. Overall, comparison of the current field behavior to that seen in the rock record indicates that the field is very unlikely to flip in the next 2,000 years. Nevertheless, it's worth keeping an eye on what the magnetic field is doing. The Earth's magnetic field helps to protect us from space weather events driven by the Sun, and the ongoing changes in the strength and orientation of our magnetic field may be reducing that protection.